of the unguarded garden. Followed. Are you sure, Peter? Positive. Followed by what? A fox? No, not a fox. Then what? <gasps> ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> What's following us? Peter! <laughs> a little sister who won't stay home. <laughs> I knew it was cut and tell all along. I just wanted to, um, practice my diving. <laughs> How did she creep up on us like that? She's super sneaky. Runs in the family. Peter, play peekaboo. Sorry, Cottontail. Can't play peekaboo right now. We're on an extra dangerous adventure. We are? Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, we are. <laughs> We've completely run out of radishes. Hungry. You'd better run home, Cottontail, before anything dangerous comes our way. Um, something dangerous is already coming our way. Uh, uh... Quick, hide! Mr. McGregor. Uh, Mr. McGregor is going. Who cares where he's going? The important thing is he's gone, and that means... Of course! Of course what? No, no one, one is guarding, guarding his garden! garden. while we can. Lily's right. We can feed all our families for a week if we get enough food. Make four piles. Roots, fruits, greens and beans. <laughs> Let's hop to it. <laughs> roots, fruits, greens and beans. Roots, fruits, greens and beans. Fruits, fruits, greens and beans. Unusual. A song about food sung by food. <laughs> fruity, fruity, creamy, beanie. Fruity, fruity, creamy, beanie. Hello <laughs> <gasps> oh, there, Cottontail. Again, again. Phew. Baby Lisa. Greeny, beanie. You've 
been great, Cottontail. But better leave it to us now, OK? Uh-huh. <laughs> have we got enough? I hope so. If I have to dig up any more radishes, I might turn into one. <laughs> Mr McGregor could be back at any second. Don't worry, Lily. We're safe. In fact, why don't we have some lunch? <gasps> you took the words right out of my mouth. Mr Todd! <laughs> Run! Mind, there's plenty of other rabbits. Now, where are they? Excellent hiding, Lily. No. Uh, 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 I'm a little strawberry. I'm a little strawberry. Uh, How considerate. Providing your own strawberry garnish. Ah! Ah. Ooh. Ooh. No, stop that! Ah. Ah, not on the tweed! Wait, we can't leave without Cottontail. Where'd she go? Peter? Oh no! Somebody else tag along today, did they? Uh, you don't want my little sister, you want me! Uh, uh. Peter, over here! Where are those rabbits hiding? Come out, come out, wherever you are. There's no way we can all get past Mr. Todd. <gasps> We're trapped! A good rabbit never gives up. <gasps> Peter, look who's back. Yay! Kitty cat! No, Cottontail. Not yay. If the cat's back, that means Mr. McGregor's back too. <gasps> and he's even more dangerous than a fox. <gasps> I know that for a fact. Yes, that's it. We get Mr. McGregor to scare off Mr. Todd for us. That's right. We get Mr. McGregor to... Wait, what? It's easy. We wake the cat, the cat alerts Mr. McGregor. But how do we get close enough? We can't. But I bet someone small and super sneaky could get through that gap. <gasps> Want to play peekaboo with a kitty cat, Cottontail? <laughs> She's doing it! She's doing it! Uh-oh! I smell rabbit. Ah! Uh -huh. Well, uh, you're pretty stinky yourself. <laughs> it seems our little game of hide-and-seek is over. Yeah, but Cottontail's game of peekaboo is about to start. Let me explain a little something about the natural order, young Peter. Rabbits are scared of foxes. Fact! That's true, Mr Todd. What's the problem, Cat? But then foxes are scared of angry gardeners. Fact! Oh, what angry gardener? <laughs> oh! Mr McGregor! Stop there, you eethees! <laughs> 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 I 
just thought we would, but, you know, phew. Shame we never got any food, though. <laughs> Never say never! Uh, uh, you won't escape me now! <laughs> Good old Mr McGregor! Good old Mr McGregor? Yep! Lucky for us, he's better at growing than he is at throwing! <laughs> <laughs> really pretty greeny beanie! Let's go home! Looks like we're having a feast tonight! Who's hungry? Roots, roots, greens and beans. Roots, roots, greens and beans. <laughs> roots, roots, greens and beans. A tale of Jeremy Fisher's recital. You can run, but you can't hide, Peter. Hide? I wasn't trying to hide from me, Mum. You were trying to avoid Mr Jeremy Fisher's musical recital. Now, I know you'd rather play in the woods all day, but... I'd rather do anything than go to that recital. What was that? I, uh, said, uh, Mr Fisher's recital. Is that today? Uh, let's go! <laughs> oh, Mum, I, uh, I heard that uh, Mr Fisher lost his voice. Can't sing a note. Oh, well. Huh? Well, I spoke to him this morning, Peter, and his voice was fine. Come on, this way. Oh, uh, maybe it wasn't his voice I heard about. <laughs> maybe it was, uh, flies! Yes, flies! Flies have taken over the lake. Very bitey. We, we probably shouldn't go. And Jeremy Fisher was just telling me how few flies there are this year. Now stop all this fibbing and hurry up. All our friends are going and I don't want to be late. Hop to it. <sighs> I know. Doesn't it look beautiful? Absolutely beautiful. What? Oh, my. Someone's taken my chair. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, dear. This is going to be so much fun. Hmm. At least you're here, too. I didn't really want to come, but Mum and Dad told me no strawberry picking until after the recital. I couldn't wait to come. Have you seen the cakes we get to eat afterwards? Mmm! Uh, music! Yay! Peter, turn around. It's starting. I'd like to welcome you all to my recital. A great poet once said, if music be the food of love, play on. <laughs> so, let's get on with it, shall we? <clears throat> I'll tell you all a story if you wish <laughs> About a lonely old frog who fell in love with a fish The fish was silver, the frog was green But he was her king and she was his, her queen <laughs> oh, 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 what a horrible racket! <gasps> Knock me sideways and call me a river rat! Look at all that lovely cake! They fell in love under the sky so blue what? A frog and a fish in a pond before is trying to steal the cakes. Peter, I told you, no more fibs. But he... Shh, no talking during the performance. <gasps> what are we going to do? Let's hop to it. Thank you, friends. Thank you. And now, for my next piece, let's... Rock out, shall we? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no, what? Those 
cakes are for after the recital, Sammy Whiskers. Oh, buzz off. <laughs> hey, oh, what's the big idea? Benjamin! Huh? Uh, yeah, right. Oh, come on. Just a bite. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Uh-uh. No way. <laughs> you just try and stop me. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 You'll be sorry. Oh, rabbits. Peter, what are you doing over here? Uh, it was Sammy Whiskers. We stopped him from stealing the cakes. Look. Uh, uh, oh, really? Well, I don't see any rats. I only see three mischievous rabbits who should be in their seats. Rabbits making an honest thief go hungry. What? Uh, oh, hey! Uh, oh, oof, uh, oh what, what do you think you're doing, Mr. Todd? Nothing much, Mr. Whiskers. Just out for a spot of lunch. I was hoping for rabbit, but perhaps a well fed rat uh, would make an easier uh, meal today. <laughs> uh, hoping for rabbits, were you? I, I, I know where you can bag a whole bunch of them easy as pie. You'd better not be telling me fibs, Whiskers. Uh, no, I'm, I'm telling you all the rabbits you could ever want. Uh, right out in the open, they are. Well, then, what are you waiting for, dear fellow? Lead the way. <laughs> Oh, very good, Mr. Whiskers. Very good indeed. A veritable feast just waiting to be gobbled up. Rabbit for me and cake for you. <laughs> Music to my ears, Mr. Todd. <laughs> Mum, I think I saw Mr. Todd's tail in the reeds. For the last time, Peter, stop telling fibs. But I'm not! I... Shh! No talking during the performance. And now, for my grand finale. A selection from my days as a ballet dancer. Always had good legs, you know. <laughs> Tra -la 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 -la. Hey, listen, I think I saw something in the reeds. What? Just keep your eyes peeled for that sneaky fox! Oh no! Exactly! How did you know I was going to say fox? fox? So, what's oh. good to eat around here? Run for the trees! <laughs> oh my! Is this part of the show? Oh dear, it's not! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is the funniest thing I've seen in ages. <laughs> Everyone, back to the woods. Come on, girls. Peter! Whoa, nice move, Mum. Take that. Peter, hurry. Let's go, Benjamin. You too, Lily. Fast. Look, Mum. That fox. I doubt he was even invited. Come along! Come on now! Oh, no, no, no. Everyone's escaped. Not quite everyone. Tra la la la, tra la la la, tra la la la. As it happens, I do have a delicious recipe for frog's legs. <laughs> Mr. Fish is in trouble! Tra -la -la -la. Hungry foxes ah. eat frogs! I know that for a fact! Rabbit's brave! Rabbit's brave! Uh. Uh -uh. What? Oh. What? Back off, Mr. Todd! <laughs> <laughs> this show just gets better and better! <laughs> Peter Rabbit, always playing the hero. Sadly, it looks like this will be your last performance. <laughs> Hurry, Peter! <laughs> He's stuck! What are we going to do, Peter? We can't fight Mr. Todd off forever. 
A good rabbit never gives up. <laughs> Peter Rabbit. Stand your ground. You've got no chance to get away. Stand your ground. Come on, think fast and you can save the day. You can't just run. This game is all or none. You've got to use your wits to get you through. So stand your ground. Yes, well, um, uh, uh, <laughs> suit is ruined. <laughs> you, this is all your fault, you snivelling rodent. Now, take it easy, Mr. Todd. I knew I was good, but this, this is too kind. Thank you. <laughs> well, perhaps just one more number then. <laughs> I'm sorry, Peter. I should have believed you about Mr. Whiskers and Mr. Todd. No, I'm sorry, Mum. I shouldn't have made stuff up in the first place. Oh, Peter. <laughs> Shh! Please, Mrs. Rabbit, no talking during the performance. <laughs> the Tale of the Peekaboo Rabbits. Great idea, Peter. <laughs> yep. Much easier to grab the radishes after Mr. McGregor has picked them. Ready? Ready! Ready! <laughs> <laughs> this is almost too easy. We're going to have enough radishes to last a lifetime. <laughs> <gasps> Peter! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. McGregor's coming back. Let's go! <sighs> huh? My radishes! Disappeared. Where's Benjamin? <gasps> Here I am, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Next time, can you try throwing them a little slower? Who stole my radishes? Show We'd yourself. better get out of here. But how are we going to carry them all? I hadn't thought of that. We could use my wagon, but it's back at your burrow. One of us could go and get it. Till I get my hands on you, Radish Rabbit! <gasps> I'll go! Hurry back, Benjamin! <laughs> okay, Lily's wagon. Lily's wagon. Uh, <gasps> aha! There you are! Uh. I don't have time to play peekaboo. I'm on a super important secret mission. <sighs> but I promise I'll play with you when I'm done. <laughs> Good idea, Lily. They should hide the radishes. Show yourselves, <gasps> Robert! <laughs> Aha! I can hear you, you wee rascals! That should keep him busy. Come on, Benjamin, hurry! What was that? You scared the stuffing out of me. I thought you were Mr. Todd. <laughs> Mr. Toddy. Oh, 
you choose to sneak up on me. <laughs> Peekaboo! <laughs> Peekaboo! <laughs> Get down! He's heading this way. We'd better go. But... Okay. Let's grab as many radishes as we can. Benjamin should have been back by now. Funny, how mad Peter and Lily are going to be if I don't get back. Now, where did I leave that wagon? The path must be this way. No, that way. No, oh, it's nowhere. <sighs> We're lost. Don't worry, Cottontail. Everything's under control. Rabbit's brave. Rabbit's brave. Oh. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Stop saying that. Benjamin! That's my wagon! But where's Benjamin? Benjamin! Where are you? Look, these must be his tracks. Hmm. And there's another set of tracks, much smaller. <gasps> oh no! Cottontail! It looks like she went into the shadowy woods with Benjamin. We've got to find them! Before someone else does. Mr Todd and Old Brown love hunting in these woods. I know that for a fact. Let's hop to it. <laughs> There's nothing to be afraid of. As long as I'm here, Cousin Tell, Brave is my middle name. <laughs> Fellas and Fluff, what's that noise? Blundering bunnies, you woke me up! Ah! Ah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry! Ah! Oh, tail feathers, they've disappeared! Rotten rabbits, I'll find you! Tail feathers! Shh. What's that? It could be them! Come on! I think old Brown has gone. Something else is coming. Hmm, nope. Feed him! Come on! Off you go. No time to lose. You best be on your way. Proceed with care. Think fast and stay aware. And you'll succeed at once. You're trying to do So off you go And you should know The golden reach is waiting there for you ah! Oh, Cottontail, I'm so glad you're okay Benjamin, where is he? <laughs> Peter and Lily, funny You scared us Rob's brave, Rob's brave Benjamin, it's me <laughs> Oh, it's you! <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, it's you! I knew that all along. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's this? A rabbit wagon? We've been looking for you everywhere. I'm really, really sorry, Peter. <laughs> Rabbits. I promise I was on my way back, but I kind of got caught up playing peekaboo with Cottontail. And then we got lost, and then old Brown nearly got us. And then there were these scary noises, and then... <laughs> well, 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 what have we here? Well 
played, my dear. You gave me quite a fright. What say we play a different sort of game? Yay! Have you ever played Hop in the Pot? And then we saw something moving towards us, but it turned out to be you. I'm really, really sorry. That's OK, Benjamin. But I think it's time we got home. Wait a second. Where's Cottontail? Cottontail! Cottontail! We've got to find her! <laughs> oh no! Mr Todd's got her! What's we going to do? Save her, that's what! Come on! Wait, Peter! <laughs> oh. You can't just rush into this without a plan, Peter. Cottontail could get hurt. <laughs> Oh, oh, stop doing that. I don't like that game. You scared me senseless. <laughs> Mr. Todd is scared of Peekaboo. I've got an idea. Follow me. Not far now, my little snack sized rabbit. My lair is just over this hill. <laughs> Peekaboo! <gasps> Peekaboo! Oh. <laughs> Come on, Cottontail! Oh, come back here! Faster! Oh, uh, you think you can hide from me, eh? Well, this is one hungry fox who won't give up until his belly is full of rabbit. Yeah, perhaps. <laughs> Come on, let's hop to it. Uh, I really don't like this game. They're back! It's worked! Woohoo! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. Too bad we lost all those radishes. Not all of them. <gasps> Brilliant! <laughs> I thought we'd never make it out. There was nothing to worry about with Cottontail along to protect you. Right, Cottontail? Cottontail? Oh, no. She's gone again! Peek-a-boo! <laughs> 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 